Today we're headed to Natural Bridge, Virginia. Never been there before. Here it's a bridge made of rock. We'll see what it's all about. Let's go. I'm driving. <laughs> I have to be in that seat. Why? Because that's the driver's seat. Oh, you're driving? I'm driving. Oh. Moab gets the, the ham from the, from the McDonald's. Oh yeah, that's the good stuff though. Can't drop it, Mel. Ow! What is this place? Look at that. That is creepy. It doesn't make any sense. Look at that. What is that? Oh. It's like a tower thing up there. And then over here there's this like tick thing or something. And it's got like a cowboy on top of it. I don't know. Looks like Alice in Wonderland or something. This is scary. <laughs> Look at it. there's like a dragon back here. I I don't think I'll be able to see it. This is just getting creepier and creepier. But there's a hole in it. Oh, let's look in the hole. Oh shit, there's somebody there. What? Synopsis of that place is that it was really creepy. We're gonna it was, have nightmares. We might have nightmares, but it was definitely awesome. The area around the natural bridge is a little more economically depressed than we kind of thought maybe it would be. A lot of trailer parks, a lot of broken dreams, and an elephant. All right, that's the entrance. We're here. Whoops. Are you good to go, Mo? Are you good? Oh boy. Ladies and gentlemen, the natural bridge. <gasps> it's a natural bridge. No. Thirsty. Wow. You can fall from this wear a hard hat. We're not wearing a hard hat. Whoa. That's the natural bridge. Route 11 actually runs across it. So I found strange. I didn't know a road went across it. Apparently, George Washington carved his initials up there. Right but there. I don't think supposedly. That's true because George how did Washington he climb up it. there and why? And was he on a boat? There are so many unanswered questions. What made him want to do that? Thomas Jefferson leased this rock shuttle out for the yellow. Whoa! They use the saltpeter to make gunpowder. That's cool. Let's go get some saltpeter. We found our friends, Chad and Liz, and they're wearing hard hats. Yahoo! There he goes. Blaze, come here. Blaze, come here. Oh God, he's come here. Fall. So we're going to Foam Hedge now. It's like Stone Hedge, but a lot softer. Thank you for visiting Foam Hedge, a full scale replica of the mystical Stone Hedge. Wow. Of England. Whoa, there it is. This is a lot better than going to England. Oh, this is crazy. This is just like Stone Hedge. Look at that wizard. What is he doing? Look at Merlin. Poor Merlin has no hands. Oh no, he does. He has he has one hand, but he doesn't have a hand over there. But I guess he like looks out over Stonehenge and 
sourcifies people. That's Merlin, who apparently lived at the same time of Stonehenge. And there's Kim. This is a weird place. Liz, you're not supposed to drink up here. Well, that was a pink Cadillac diner. I would give it two out of five stars.